Hi there, welcome to the next video and in this video I will show you how you can use another keyword argument which is having multiple star or the two star and uh, it is called quarks. So what special about this is that uh, it accepts a dictionary kind of format which is one of the very efficient method of storing and processing the data within the Python and give you the output based on your data processing within the Python. So dictionary uh, is the thing that it accepts and returns back to you based on that formatting that you are specifying. Alright, so to see this thing in action, let's define altogether a different uh, sort of a thing. Let's say uh, you have a requirement that you need, uh, you need to pass on some values uh, as uh, which is coming to you as dictionary format and pass it on to a function to print it in a proper format for the readability of end user. So what you can do is you can define a function as always like uh, format underscore report and pass quads and as I mentioned uh, in the previous videos as well where we were looking at the star arcs this value can be anything it's just that i am going ahead with the what has been notified or notation used into the documentation which is squads but it can be anything like abc xyz or anything which is more business friendly for you all right so now let's define the uh, or let's accept the input so as i mentioned earlier it accepts the dictionary format so it has dictionary has a key and value so that's what we need to iterate through for key comma value in quarks dot items and then simply print the value so we have key plus a space and then str value in case if it is a numeric value you want to pass um, so that's pretty much all you need so just to revise that we are defining a function with the star star quarks which accepts dictionary format we are iterating the dictionary's key comma value in quarks dot items and printing the key and value now let's execute this and call this function so to call it simply pass format underscore report and let's say it is a sales report so we need to specify the arguments for that let's say our key is uh, country and maybe our country is japan and sales is in uh, hundred thousand dollars maybe if i go in and execute this what it gives me country is japan sales is one thousand what i'll do is even i can specify the uh, simple separator which is a dash Execute it again, execute it again. So country, Japan, sales, 1000. Similarly, if I have the another call, let's say country is India and sales is $5,000, then I get the formatted output based on. But what I really want to, wanted to show you is that uh, this is just a basic example, but even it, it can have hundreds of uh, country information and uh, sales information then simply you pass on this simple value and it gives you the output in the required format in the next video i will show you how you can pass the multiple values right now what i'm doing is i'm passing japan as a separate line and uh, country as a separate line but in the next video i will show you how you can uh, combine all of these things and provide the argument to your function and get the output.